Welcome back to On Air. <laughs> The, the, British the, yeah. British the British podcast. The British podcast. The podcast where we're British, we're British and we know what? how to talk like British people. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh no. no. <laughs> oh no. Wait, that's us. Oh no. That's, that's us. Oh, oh no. <laughs> no, I've gone Australian. <laughs> I've gone Australian. I fell for it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I fell for the. God, I, I can't hold an accent. Nobody's drinking the book, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yep. All right, let's talk about what uh, talk this about episode's about. We're, 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 we're this we're episode doing is three about three movies. Our two special two movies. Technically, three. technically three. We're whatever. We're doing the Cornetto trilogy because we're it's our twentieth episode. We're s- so one hour, one. One, one hour special. One hour, as you may have seen yeah, on the time Yeah, if you stamp. haven't gotten sick of us already, um, <laughs> you yeah, here you go. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy, this is going to be so much fun, and we will be able to retain energy for one hour. Oh boy, oh boy. So, as you may be able to tell, <laughs> we came dressed as, as characters. Oh my gosh, <laughs> what? Simon Pegg's characters. From the movie, from the, from all the movies. There's from one the, movie. There's one movie. And, he, and he's multi. He's a bunch of guys. Yeah, he was he was two guys in Shaun of the Dead. So who what? He was two guys in Shaun of the Dead. For that one scene. What one scene? The one where the, uh, Shaun and his group meet. Um, they you, meet no, up. No, with... no, he wasn't. Are you thinking of the guy from The Hobbit? And also, what I, are you talking about? I forget his name. I know the scene you're Write talking down his, about. Yeah, please yeah. tell me his name. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. It's is that not, not it's him? It's not him. It's it's really? his friend who who is in World's End. I'm, oh, that guy! I, geez, he, he looks weird. Bald. Bald. Martin Freeman. Martin oh, yeah. Freeman. Yeah. Well, I my that. apologies. He I own up to Hobbit. that mistake, guys. I thought they looked similar. He was Whatever. one of the guys in Marvel, like Black Panther, Civil War. Yeah. Oh, that guy. Yeah. Oh, that's where I know him from. There you go. I, f- I finally, I finally, I actually. God, okay. Stop, stop making fun of me. It's not funny. Anyways, um, I finally figured it out. <laughs> it's, it's not funny. It's not funny. It's not. It's not funny, guys. Um, you guys <laughs> make me so mad sometimes. Me thinks that's I'm not sorry. funny. <laughs> Are okay, Jar Jar Binks. No, I. That's Misa. <laughs> Misa thinks you said not funny. We're not doing Phantom Menace, so let's move on. I agree. Um, you are a menace, though. Oh, of the paranormal just got variety. Old. This thing is so itchy on the back of That's my neck. That's so funny. And Who? I hate it. <laughs> Sorry. What? <laughs> Anyways, we're so let's good talk about. Yeah. Let's let's. Uh, it, we've taken. We took a week off. That's where we're rusty. Okay. But you didn't. Let, they didn't need to know that. Okay, I let's this, this, let's no. let's talk. Le- Cause we were behind. Le- <laughs> but they didn't need to know that. <laughs> let's, talk about the first movie. Oh. let's talk about a shot of the dead. Yeah. This could have all stayed silent behind the scenes, Una. Let's talk about Let's Shaun talk of the about Dead. Shaun of the Dead. I'm Gaffin dressed Uplink. as Sean from Shaun of the Dead. Yep. If you couldn't tell, we're, we're I even got the, you. I even got the pen. I'm so cool. Spilling. You got red no. on you. No. I refuse to ruin this shirt. Spilling. You got red on you. Thank you. You got red on you. You got red on you. You got red on you. I like how that line comes back. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I, I, I do. Does that a lot. I feel like it's cool. all of the um, running jokes throughout all the movies were like good, and they didn't like happen too often to the point where it was like annoying. Like, I, I yeah. thought it happened, the like... The fence bit was... Oh, history. the fence bit was awesome. Like, probably the, one of the most well-known jokes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Running jokes in the movie. Literally movie. running. Running and mm-hmm. jumping over the fence. And breaking the <laughs> fence. I hit the mic. <laughs> anyway. Stupid mic. All right. Yeah. <laughs> he got what's coming to All him. All right. Let's, let's give our general thoughts about uh, Shaun of the Dead. Shaun of the Dead. Let's, We're going to be let's... doing the worst for the Dead. Shaun of the Dead. All right. Shaun of the Dead. Shaun of the Dead. Shaun of the Dead. Who wants to go first with their general thoughts of Shaun of the Dead? This is riveting. I like the movie. Um, is that all? Well, no. Okay. It was, I like the movie a lot. Oh, is that all? No. Oh, okay, then keep going. I like the movie a lot, a whole bunch. Oh my goodness. Keep going. 
I, I, I like the movie Hope <laughs> a whole bunch, a good amount, very much so. All right, Una, why don't you give your job? Wait, I'm not. Done. No, you're done now. You're done um, now. Yeah, I do like this movie a lot. Like mm-hmm. one of my favorite movies of all time, as are all three of these movies, just because mm-hmm. Edgar Wright's like really cool and mm-hmm. awesome. But I think it's it's my least favorite out of the trilogy. Mm-hmm. I will say, and I know you said it was your favorite. Yeah, out of it is my favorite. So I'm, out I'm of curious trilogy. to hear our clashing opinions on I that. I think all three. This is good because I think all three of us have a different favorite of the trilogy. Yours is Sean. Hot Fuzz. Yours is Hot Fuzz, right? Yeah. Wait, and that's actually really End. funny. We're dressed as oh, yeah. all the same game. Hot that Fuzz was and we're dressed as our favorites. It just that was worked so out. Funny. That, that wasn't planned. We just wanted to go yeah. in order. Yeah. That is true. Yeah. We're and I think it's sort of smart. Yeah. I don't know. But when we're not thinking about it. Uh-huh. Yeah, we didn't mean to be smart, but... <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I'm sorry, I'll be stupid next time. You got, you kind of I promise, me, I man. promise I'll be a dumb dumb next time, guys. <laughs> the I, lollipop? I, sorry. I really like those lollipops. Anyways, let's move on before we get sidetracked. Right. So what did you think of this movie? You well, know? obviously, as you just mentioned, it... The, this one is my favorite out of um, the trilogy, which is weird because it's not like one of my all-time favorite movies like i don't know it's weird because like i think i like hot fuzz as like one of my favorite movies ever but out of this trilogy Shaun of the dead is better just i don't know why i don't know how it works but that's how but that's what it is it's best not to question why it works like that but but i don't get what you're saying (laughs) Are you put? Wow, are you picking you up what I'm putting same down? Same kind of thing he did. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. I I like it. It's my favorite, mm-hmm. but it's not my favorite. No, but I, it's mine. I get what you're saying, and also I don't get what you're saying. No, I'm. No, I said I get what you're saying, but okay. I get what you're saying. So Shaun of out of no. the Cornetto trilogy, don't, Shaun of the Dead is my favorite. I'm... Shut up. Out of <laughs> Shaun of the Dead. Oh my god. Out of the Cornetto trilogy, Shaun of the Dead is my favorite. But out of every movie in the world, Hot Fuzz is one of my like top two favorites. So in your list of your favorite movies ever, Hot Fuzz is above Shaun of the Dead. Mm-hmm. But in terms of the trilogy... Shaun of the Dead is higher than... Mm. Yeah. I, I, think it, I think it's more like... The, the trilogy is more like story-wise I like Shaun of the Dead better. And... Well, I, and, um, but, like, in general, like, f- f- cinema- cinematography-wise and, like, all that other stuff, I like Hot Fuzz better. Mm. I should have explained that a little better so the first time. My well, bad. You know, we're not good at this, so it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, yeah, um. <laughs> I can't tell if that was sarcastic or not. No, that was, like, genuine, like, th- thanks. Oh. I'm not always sarcastic, you know. I did. I wasn't implying you were. Anyways, uh, let's um, let's talk about our f- the f- characters we liked in Shot of the Dead, because that's the movie I we're hate talking David about. So much. Oh my god, I hate. David. Oh my I hate god, David. I he hate was David. okay. First off, he was literally like like um, I yeah I agree. I don't like David either. <laughs> he was no he like was literally David. like he's so dumb. I hate him. He was literally like. Oh, what was it? He was, like, putting his emotions in the way of, like, the greater survival. He was like, I don't like you, so I'm going to shoot your mom because you, like, you you dated the girl I liked. Which, like, come on, man. You're in the middle of a zombie apocalypse. He fully and, pulled the trigger. Mm-hmm. And, like, on, on, and, like, Sean, he, the reason he went back for Liz was because he cares about her. And he also went back for her friends as well. It's not like he only went back for Liz. He came back for the others, too. Mm. Uh, like, yeah. So oh, he he wasn't getting his emotions there. He was just trying to get all the people that he knew to safety that he could, you know. I don't, I like Sean. He's a nice guy. Yeah. I think this. He's movie me core like... too. Oh my! Oops. I have my. I want to. There's a thing I want to talk about with him uh, a little later. Uh, okay. Not right now because we're talking I about favorite characters. I think this movie is like but... every American's dream for for the British to be wiped out <laughs> by a virus. <laughs> God bless I'll, America. You know what? You know what? I don't mind the British. I know that's a hot take here in America. I don't like the way your face just fell. I really don't. <laughs> <laughs> you were like, uh. Porter's going to be coming. Actually, Ooh. no, he doesn't like the French, which is 
understand. No, why are we getting so... <laughs> Una, I know you don't like France, but please, let's, let's stay on track here. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't say anything! <laughs> I know, that's why it's funny. Awesome. Anyway, how'd you like the movie, Una? No, we're no. talking about characters. Characters, uh, what, characters. Did, we, did Una say anything? No. This? What? We didn't get... I we... said I didn't like David. Um, well, no, your general thoughts on the movie. Yes, she actually did. Oh, I did, yeah. Oh, okay, I wasn't listening. I'm not a good <laughs> attention bearer. Yeah, listen to her, man. You never listen to her. It's like you hate her or something. <laughs> 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 it's okay we're like hear me out yeah. <laughs> no I don't think I will here's my powerpoint presentation on why we shouldn't listen to it. oh my god you gotta make your own podcast about Una hate <laughs> <laughs> oh man oh man <laughs> okay uh, but I do agree with you David not great bad David we don't like him I, I like concur. Diane though I actually thought she was really cool but oh, then, yeah, yeah, and, yeah. but then, and I was like, "Wow, she's so cool and an awesome sauce." David. But then she ran out yeah. into the thing, oh, and yeah. I was like, "Oh." Also, she's an actor. There's a thing mm -hmm. where um, it's like a uh, what's it called? Like, not behind the scenes, but it's like a storyboard or comic or something. Comic, I think, I think. Mm -hmm. where she survives. Where, yeah, she climbs yeah, up no, a tree they, and they survives by afterwards. eating David's leg or something. <laughs> what well, the she freak? She sleeps in a tree overnight till the. Military yeah. people come. Yeah, I know. I heard about that. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, I'm glad she survived. Yeah, she's cool. Well, it, it, whether it's Kim or not, who knows, but, you know. Yeah. I'm sure our f friend from outside would know and would tell us in a second. Ooh. Oh, that one. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> she I just she said she forgot about you. She forgot about you. She, she just looked at us and was like... <laughs> no, I think my favorite character might be either Sean or Liz. Just That's fair. Sean is funny, but Liz is also like competent. Yeah, and she's also like not one of those really obnoxious like stop it partners where she's <laughs> like asking for a whole bunch. Right. And this guy like can't. It is on Sean. Yeah. Like a hundred percent. I like I. He's, I he's trying just not as hard as he could. could be, yeah. But Liz, I think, is like reasonable and. She yeah. makes a good point, which is a, like ultimately mm -hmm. what causes Sean to change as mm -hmm. a person, and that's that's cool. Yeah, I like his stepdad played by Bill Nye. He's funny, yeah. Bill Nye. He's Bill in he's Nye. in all of the Bill movies. Bill Nye, the science guy, which I think is <laughs> yeah. cool. They brought him back in Hot Fuzz. He plays the uh, chief the, inspector. Yeah, the chief inspector, and then in Sheriff. World's End, he's the voice of the like the I don't know what is the name. network. Yeah, the network. Uh, Why yeah. do I know that off the top of my head? I know I just watched the you movie watched yesterday, night, but yeah. Yeah, I, I like. Didn't remember uh, that. But yeah, Bill Nye it was really good. It's, I love the I love the little bit where she's like, she's like, um, he's like, um. Did you just misgender him? Stop! I, my <laughs> uh, no. wow, we're gonna tell him. <laughs> I and gotta we're gonna issue like a canceled. YouTube apology. I made a severe lapse in my judgment. <laughs> yeah. Um. But yeah, I like the scene where he's in the he's at Sean's work and he's like, "You're gonna get her flowers," uh, and he's like, oh, "You should get her flowers this time." And he's like, "I was I was gonna," and then he's like, "Not the cheap gonna. ones, uh, not the cheap ones from like a girl, or whatever." Mm -hmm. And he's like, "I wasn't gonna." Yeah, that's mm -hmm. funny. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Mm yeah, and it also helps <laughs> with Sean's character a whole lot mm -hmm. too, because that's like towards the start, and it's like you can tell he has his priorities mm -hmm. sometimes. And then he gives flowers to mm -hmm. Liz and stuff. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Um, there was one thing about, um, Sean's character that, like, halfway through the movie, I was like, Sean seems kind of neurodivergent. And then that's the only thing I, like... <laughs> that's, like, taken over my brain, and it's how I just think of him now. And I... Don't know if they did it on purpose like that or if he really is just kind of stupid towards the beginning. But personally, I just felt like he was just neurodivergent but undiagnosed and no one knew. So they, so no one like was like, I don't know. So he like had no way to like cope with that. It was just kind of not great at doing things. 
undiagnosed, you mean like Una with that? Oh who, my god, no. Who sh- probably has ADHD? <laughs> um, I'm just saying. Yeah, anyways. Anyway. Um, but yeah, I don't know. He just. And then. And then the. And I also felt so, a similar way towards Ed as well. And that's why. And I felt like that's why the two of them, like, were super close together. Are either of you even listening to me? Yes. Yeah. Yes, chef. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna wait, wait. What is um? What does Gordon Ramsay sound like again? He sounds like. What are you? <laughs> what are you? An idiot, An idiot sandwich. sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anyways, uh, back to what I was saying. Uh, I was. I also felt kind of similarly towards Ed, like especially in the scene where they're in the backyard and they're like throwing the records, and the the way that they just handle that situation was like these oh, guys yeah, are no. just neurodivergent it, it, and don't know it and have just like, cl- like. Just cling it's on like, to each other because they have no other like, like way of coping. Right, no, what, what, no, Batman sound, Batman soundtrack. Throw it. Yeah. And um, oh, the oh, God, the the love... scene where uh, or like at the very beginning where Sean is like very clearly like in his own little bubble and he's like not paying attention to his surroundings and like uh and he thinks of himself before other people. That just seems like a neurodivergent thing to me. And it's not really like a him being selfish thing, just that's just how he functions normally and he has to like make himself do stuff otherwise to like actually, you yeah, know, function. Reminds me. Yeah, go the for way it. he stands up like when um I, what's the the roommate's name? Ooh, I don't know. What is his name? Why do I feel like it's I just watched a kill count on this. Um, get refreshed. Um, but anyway, the guy that they live with, when he's yeah. like getting all mad at Ed, I love the way Sean defends Ed. Like, oh yeah, there's he such totally good does not deserve it. Ed is a terrible roommate. He leaves mm-hmm. a mess everywhere. He's not a good friend. Mm-hmm. Pete. 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 Yeah, 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 I knew it. Thanks, Desiree. <laughs> you can bleep that. You don't want to say anything. Anyways. You've said it several times on this uh, podcast before. Oh, uh, oh crap! Whoa! Whoa! Anyways, oh uh, shoot! <laughs> oh dang it! Oh, darn it! Dad gummit. Anywho, so um, Anywho. uh, but yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know. That that's just what I think. That's how I view it, at least, or their characters, at least. That's how just how I think of them. I like the scene when. <laughs> <laughs> that's how I think of them. I like the scene when they're in the bar and he's like, "Well, I didn't draw the attention of the zombies by having a, was it tizzy." What I don't know, tizzy, yeah. By having a tizzy with my boyfriend, he's like, he's not my boyfriend. <laughs> might be a little. Here's a beer. Might be a little warmer than usual. Thanks, Thanks babe. babe. Yeah, it's so, so funny. Good. I love the way they interact. And then the, how the Ed still stays in the yard in the shed. Yeah, they interact like they're actual friends. Not yeah. Like us. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. Sorry. No, I was like time. genuinely clearing my throat. That's I wasn't. Um, <clears throat> no, there was like genuinely phlegm in my guy. throat. Uh, <clears throat> I actually genuinely care about you guys. I'll have you know. <clears throat> Doofus. Sorry. That was directed towards him, by the way. Not you. Mm. You're awesome. In the wise Thank words you. of Ed, gay. <laughs> what? Because at the end of the movie, <laughs> I got to defend myself. <laughs> <laughs> at, the end of the, at the end of the movie, when. <laughs> He's about to go up on the lift. <laughs> and Sean says, I love you. And then Ed goes, gay. <laughs> it sounds like something I would do. Yeah. I probably wouldn't, actually. I say I love you to my friends all the time without making it weird. <laughs> gay. Shut up, man. <laughs> this is why we can't have nice things, because you're here. <laughs> Wow. This is why I won't be allowed back on the podcast anymore. Yeah, we're going to ban you from here, actually. <laughs> First you called Bill Nye Ishii, now this. Can't believe it. <laughs> yeah, we're yeah. going to ban you, I'm, man. I'm, Maybe we should misgender you. This episode's going to be titled Theo Gets Cancelled, Not Clickbait. Did you just say Shio? <laughs> Shio. <laughs> I beg your pardon? <laughs> Shio. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, when when I'm given like a, a a female, you know, name, it's like I don't know, Theodora. Thelma. 
No, it's, it's usually Theodora. Theodora? But Theodora the Explorer. Shio, I'm just going to be like, if anyone ever calls me Theodora, <laughs> I'm just going to be like, sorry, it's Shio. <laughs> it's Shio. No, it should be Shia because cause O is for... Anyways, it doesn't matter. Oh, it's for orangutan. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, like the like the like the, the orangutan the, like, impression. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And we full we circle. Were, it was all this, 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 this You was just a, got epic pranked. We were on top of Oh my god! This was a this was a pre-planned bit. Yeah, totally. We, knew, we know what we're doing. And um, yeah. I think we should talk about. <laughs> I think we're past our time. I think we need to talk about uh. Uh, oh. The World's End? No, uh, Hot Fuzz. Why? We already had an episode on that. Because we're link, doing the link, trilogy. Link. We're just gonna no. go over. Oh, link and Duskrap. Oh, link, link, link to that episode. Uh. We can just spend a couple <laughs> minutes. In case people, in case people don't want to go watch that whole thing. In case people don't want to go watch that whole thing. It was can, great. Can, I liked it. They can just that have was a good episode, here. I think. Wait, actually, well, yeah, are we going to do all of the ratings, kind of final ratings at the end, or should yeah. we do our final ratings for Shaun of I the Dead I think we should now? do all of them at the end. Okay. okay. <laughs> link will be below. Link in description. Uh, link will oh, be yeah, below. Yeah, yeah. Link will be uh, below. Uh, 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 Click uh, that link down below. To the Hot Fuzz episode. Hot Fuzz like button. Subscribe to the link below for more epic uploads like this one. Subscribe to Bevcam. Yeah. Yeah, shout out to Bevcam. subscribe to me. I'm cool. We're not linking your channel, buddy. We should link his channel. We should. It would be funny. For no reason. Uh, and I just you. look at my my channel tomorrow morning. I just or not tomorrow morning. This isn't going up. <laughs> this isn't going going up tomorrow. Be surprised if this went up at all. <laughs> anyway, yeah. I beg your pardon. It's anyway, how bad this is going. No, <laughs> this it's is going, going great, it's going guys. It's going awesome. And I'm Gary King, and there's only one Gary King, except for the t- the times when there's multiple Gary Kings. Right. Uh, uh-huh. But then there's only one Gary King. So should we talk about? Movies probably the, yeah. hot, the, the world ends then. Well, let's just do a little more quickly, hot quickly. We, just like go over hot fuzz. We my, liked wh- it. We already my went over the trilogy. Favorite? Very cl- world's end is very close. Was, Super close second. Um, it was good. I really liked it. One of my favorite movies. Sorry, I'm looking directly at you. It's just the way. It was I... good. I, I liked really it. liked, I liked it, it. Okay. I really liked it. <laughs> I don't remember what I rated it. I think I rated it five out of five, maybe four point five. I don't remember mm. exactly. I do remember it was really high up there. So uh, it is really good. One of my all-time favorite movies. Probably tied with uh, Rear Window. I think the two, those two movies. I just shoot at the top and they're tied for first right now. Uh, I don't have any other favorite movies, so it's not... They shoot at the top because they use guns they in use this movie. Guns. Uh-huh, yeah. They use this guns. This is one of the few they're times cops. you're gonna see Brits, those, those stupid Brits, <laughs> <laughs> use guns. You are all over the stuff that could be controversial today. Oh, huh? yeah. I'm, I'm absorbing no more British it all. People are gonna he wants watch this, this podcast to end on the 20th episode, so he's trying yeah. his best to cancel uh, yeah, it. No, I'm, yeah, I'm absor- no, I'm absorbing all... I'm, I'm saying all the controversial stuff. Oh, so, so we're that it, saying... It, yeah, you, you guys are saying... Oh, thank you, Theo. We yeah. appreciate In you. Reality, well, I'm I do, at least. I don't self- know about her. The camera's over there. <laughs> I'm a very selfless person. Oh. Uh-huh, yep. That's what they call me. They call me old self... Camera went that way. <laughs> they call me old selfless Theo. They I don't think they call you selfless that. They call me old selfless Shio. <laughs> I'm so glad that got a lot of laughter. <laughs> and, I feel, and I feel great about myself right now. Y- you um, should because that was so funny. It's okay. Mm-hmm. You're funny, Theo. I mean, Shio. <laughs> Don't take me. I love this bit, and we're uh, and, uh, gonna move on. We're gonna, yeah, sure, whatever. Can we talk about the world's end now? Yeah, me, me, Gary King. Gary, Gary, King, Gary, King, Gary, King, Gary King. Gary King. All right, general thoughts, everybody. You can go first. I really like the movie. It's my favorite of the trilogy. I just like sci-fi. And That's it's, fair. It's fun. Sci-fi so, is really cool. It is. You know. I don't think I'm Star usually Wars. a big sci-fi person, but this one was. It was, it was cool. Yeah, like stuff movies like Star Wars, <laughs> Alien. <laughs> hey, we're talking about this movie. Um, also, this reminds me of um, this movie. I don't know if it had anything to do with it, but the M83 music video for Midnight City, I think. 
Because don't they have glowing eyes? I, I just remember being really about. young watching that music video and it, and I feel it like scarred I, me. I've heard about it. I don't know why, seen. I just thought it was I scary. don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. It's okay, though. You show me later. Yeah, I, I will um, do that, maybe. What, what are your yeah. general thoughts? I love this movie so much. Like, I, Gary King is such an awesome character to me. Like, mm -hmm. I don't know, something about him is like... My dad got like, this shirt from Redbubble. <laughs> it's Gary King. Are you going to have to link that, too? or? No, I'm sure you can find it. Redbubble... Uh, you know what? Don't go on Redbubble. There That's you go. wild. There you go. Don't go on Red. Find any other website to get merch from. Redbubble sucks. <gasps> wow. Redbubble's not Whoa. good. It is the it is the website to get stolen, like it is the web website to get stolen designs. So. That's wild. Don't go to Redbubble. <laughs> okay. You were saying. Yeah. Where you um, jumped, did you? Th this. Hot this Fuzz is my though. favorite movie in all, but Gary King is definitely my favorite character out of <laughs> the three characters. Just because he's, like, cool and very childish. And I I feel like the like way me. he's so sentimental mm -hmm. about, like, every... Like, he wants the night to go exactly as it did before because he wants to, like, be happy again, mm -hmm. which is, like... There's that, Bloody. like... I don't know. I The more you look don't into that movie... Be happy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not on my it's not high on my priority list. But like I have therapy later I, I today. I could live without it. <laughs> but see, like, see go Ma seek Michael's help. Are, Michael's the working on it. Michael is be happy. So good job. I'm trying. Good job. Thank you. Yeah. Don't make me yeah. sob on this podcast episode, please. Sobcast. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> We're making you cry any way we can. <laughs> Laughing. <laughs> genuine tears. <laughs> well, um... I, hey, buddy. <laughs> we've achieved our goal. Michael has cried. <laughs> no, no, we, I'm not! I'm not, I'm not! I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not. We, <laughs> I, I was I a joke. We don't, we don't need to do the, the second half of this podcast No, episode. we do, we do, we do. <laughs> we, don't, we don't have to. We can just, you know. We can just, no, we can keep you know. going. <laughs> we can keep going, guys. We can keep going, guys. That's okay. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Anyways, what, what were we talking about? We should get a menthol cry stick. <laughs> <laughs> that is not what we were talking about. <laughs> yeah. The moment, the moment, I should have gotten water. <laughs> I just go to like the flex that I'm, I'm There's nothing I'm in going. this cup. This cup is empty. Shut up, Dio. I hope you choke. Anyways. Not this time. Damn it. Anywho, so. Um, Shocker, I know. Um, uh, the world's end. Are, are you done with your general yeah. thoughts, by the way? I don't want to interrupt you. Okay. No, you're good. Um, I think uh, The World's End was actually my uh, least favorite um, out of the trilogy. Uh, bec I don't know why. I think it was just, first off, the beginning uh, gave me so much secondhand embarrassment, I literally couldn't watch the screen anymore. Um, that is fair. From, yeah. from, oh, from, from Gary King. I guess uh, yeah, him being like, he, oh, oh, you, you, you. The, his kids. whole his whole thing gave me so much secondhand embarrassment, uh, it, and I was like, like if I was if I knew this guy in real life, I would be like, um, bye, and then just leave. Like I I like couldn't be around him in public. I would be way too embarrassed. Like if watching him on a screen gives me too much embarrassment to like physically want to get up and leave the room it's probably not a good sign that we get along yeah I, um I love so he, he's just so he's just so funny I, and I he's so the, confident in being wrong yeah, yeah. and i just well, actually he's never yeah. he's never wrong yeah but he's never right either <laughs> i love i love um that scene where um but um i was in the gone. car oh sorry it's okay theo you can talk in just a little she little moment okay I'm buddy Done. You can talk when I'm done. Okay, so um, uh, but it's just, and I I don't know. I felt like the 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 beginning part was a little slow on the build up, and there was no like immediate like th like small sign of like the actual aliens in the town, because like like in Shaun of the Dead, there was like subtle 
uh, like hints in the background that were uh, like you can tell that something's happening uh, with like in the background, but he's again absorbed in his own little bubble and isn't paying attention to anything around him, um, which again me core. Um, <clears throat> but uh, but there's but they're just he but Gary King is just meeting up with his friends or his old friends and. And that's fine. I understand that. But then it goes on a little too long without the aliens. The point where my mom, who was shout out my mom, uh, who was uh, uh, who was sitting on the couch next to me watching it with me, she was like, "There was a point where I was literally hiding under a pillow because I physically couldn't watch the screen." And my mom was like, "Where are the aliens already? Get to the aliens!" And I was like, "Please just skip forward in the movie. I don't need to see this part." Again, I wasn't really paying attention that well, so I might have missed some kind of build up. But from what I heard, I didn't really hear any, you know, pre-going there alien stuff. So I just, I don't know. It was a little weird uh, for the beginning, on, in my opinion. Um, but uh, but that's just me. I understand you guys really like the movie. Yeah, that's fair. Um, I liked um, but yeah. I, I, also, I liked... I'm so sorry. I have one last thing I wanted to say. The the whole like um, the moral of like the story. And, like, the resolution of, like, the whole, like, the network ending and, like, people going back to the dark ages and the whole, like, uh, to err is human, to forgive is divine. That didn't, to me, that didn't really, like, fit with, like, Gary's story. Like, it felt like, I don't know, it felt like he was the wrong character for that to me, in my opinion. Because, like, he had this whole, like, like, sure, they had, like, him and, uh, what's his name? I forget his friend's name. Which one? The the guy when they first go down, it's the two of them. There Andy? are Yeah, Andy. I don't really I don't know. I didn't pay much attention, so sorry. I know I watched it yesterday, but um yeah, Andy. Uh the I know they had like a whole conversation and then he showed him his wrists and stuff. And I was and I was like that uh didn't I don't know, that whole like conversation and then immediately jumping into like the aliens again. I don't know. It didn't really fit to me. It felt like they were trying to tell two different stories at happening at the same time. And I was like, I don't know. It, it just felt a little strange to me. Um, I, I do think if it... I, I, I don't know. I do like the idea of, like, the aliens. I just I just wish they, like, stuck to actually, like, one of them. I understand the whole, like, uh, him being really, like, determined to finish the thing. I think that would have been fine if it was just that story on its own. And it had, like... Because, um, I think Hot Fuzz was the only, like, one without any, like, weird supernatural stuff, right? It was literally just a cult of people. Um, uh, so that, I don't know. I feel like it could have had a more, like, real-life setting, and it still would have been able to tell Gary's story instead of aliens. Like, don't get me wrong, I think the whole alien-robot thing is really cool, and I like the jokes and stuff, and them coming up with, like, the term blank. I thought that whole, like, scene was really funny. Um, <clears throat> but... I don't know. It felt like Gary was try too focused on like trying to go back to his, you know, young days, the good old days that uh he wasn't really paying attention to the alien part. And like I understand that's like kind of his whole character, but I don't know. I, I don't know. That's just me though. Thanks for letting me talk about that, guys. It's your turn now. Yeah. What was I going to say? I have no clue. Awesome. <laughs> um sorry. My fault. I like I, I liked um when like the scenes where he was going to get his all his friends and he was just like manipulating all of them. Mm. And um Yeah, I, I love when my friends manipulate my Don't friends. worry, Una. I would never manipulate you. Um Gaslight like Gatekeep Girl Burst. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> the thing that Oh you weren't there, right? No. Anyway, I like I love the scene where it's like I don't know what that means. Where they're in the car, and it's like, I, uh, uh, I forget how the scene went, but I know it ends with start? him being like, no, the Bible wasn't written. Oh, but, that one. The yeah. Bible wasn't Don't written by him. Was it was written by, it was, it was written, by, written by Jesus, and then and he's like, oh, <laughs> are we there yet or whatever? Yeah. And he's like, let's go. Oh yeah, I've seen that scene before, and I didn't realize that was from this movie. So when I saw it, I was like, oh my gosh, I know that scene. Mm -hmm. It was a nice surprise. Yeah. 
I will say that the relationships and like the dynamics between them all and like the banter, the dialogue felt very natural to me. And that's one thing that I very much like about all of these movies. They all, all of them felt um, like, like relationship wise, all of them felt really like real. And I definitely understand like all that stuff. You know? I think one of the reasons I like this movie is because it's probably the most action heavy mm. one. For sure. I love I love the action because it's not just like I wish it was they, just action just from like the start. Going it's well choreographed and the camera mm-hmm. moves dynamically. It's a lot of fun. that shot. The, the fight scene in the bathroom at the very oh, start. Yeah. Oh, it's like all one Prime shot. Example. So cool. Oh yeah, and I I remember writing down a specific note about that the, the bathroom scene where. Um, uh, when they all the b- blanks were lining up to fight them, uh, uh, Gary was the first one to lunge, out of like the people, the humans. He mm. was the first one to lunge. I, I don't know why. I j- that was just something I noticed. Can I just say? I feel yeah. like all the stuff you didn't like is the stuff that I like about <laughs> it. Cause like, it was, what was the first thing you said? It was about like, uh, the. Crap. Uh, oh, you like secondhand embarrassment? Oh God, I can't. I feel like that just it. The way Gary is written is so cool to me because it's like he's he's a well written character. I know that for sure, but I just can't watch him yeah, on no, a screen. That. That's but, like how, that's how well written he is. He like has a physical he's, impact on yeah, me. He's, he's so like, well written. The effect he's su- not supposed to have, but like the effect he's giving people is like. Mm-hmm. Oh, he's so, like, insane and crazy. And then as the movie goes on, you realize it's, like, because of, like, mm-hmm. his, like, mental health stuff or whatever. Yeah. It's, I like, knew from the start. Like, when he was in the circle, I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. oh, he's he's in a he's in a mental health thingy. And I told that to my mom. And, like, the, the part where he's, like, where it, like, flashes or whatever and he's, like, getting ready to leave. I was like, oh, yeah, he's definitely in one of those. And, my, and I told my mom that. I was like, oh, yeah, he's in a thing. And, and my mom was like, uh-huh, sure. And then at the end, she was like, oh, wait, he was, like, in an actual thing. I was like, yes, I told you. Are you even listening to me? Yeah. She doesn't listen to me. That scene where he, like, risked She doesn't listen to me. Shout out to my mom. She doesn't listen to me. Shout out to my mom. She doesn't listen to me. Anyways. Mom. Shout out my mom. Yeah. That, my, Shout one out my, my favorite mom. Scenes she brought like, me this coat because I forgot it. That is true. That's so cool of your mom. Yeah. yeah. I love this scene. Shout out our mom. Thanks, like... mom. <laughs> Shout out Theo's mom. Oh. Shout out my mom. <laughs> Give the most awkward smile you can. <laughs> Perfect. Right. That's, awesome. a, that, that's a thumbnail. The, the yeah, scene totally. at the Editor's end note, they're talking with, um, thumbnail that. Gary's talking with Andy and they're like, right before they go down, mm-hmm. it's like, Oh wow, these two characters that like mm-hmm. haven't seen each other in a while and like both have like problems and they're like clashing together kind of like mm-hmm. I just think it's really cool. Like mm-hmm. especially knowing how tight those two were and like also another another thing about this movie kind of related is like all of the, the characters' last names relate to like so like Andy Knightley. Mm-hmm. Uh, Gary King knights uh-huh. like protect the right. king or whatever, so they're like super tight. But like obviously they've been best friends for a while, so it's like right. the ending scene is with them too. And also another thing about this movie, everybody becomes a uh, a blank uh, at the same pub that they right like Le- didn't make it to right. when they went through it the first time. And also, also all of the the bars. Have a name that relates to something that happens in it. I mm. think that's cool. Wait, really? Yeah, like for a hole in the wall, they drive the car through. Oh, the I thing. didn't notice a lot that. Of fun, yeah. Yeah. Also, I think it's just I like the way Edgar Wright writes Wright? things. Yeah. Red, Edgar writes Edgar things. Edgar writes. <laughs> Edgar, I, I support Edgar writes. <laughs> Um, but I think it's the okay. way he writes, like, dialogue. It's just so snappy, uh-huh. and I love that. It, it, I love... I feel like dialogue is kind of hard for some people to write, just because, like, I don't like know. Like George Lucas. I don't know who that is. Guy, He made Star Wars. Mm. Oh, my God. Uh, but he um, famously mm. cannot write good dialogue. It, like, if you've watched the prequels... So robotic. Yeah. But sometimes that happens, but like he uh Edgar Wright has some really good, nice dialogue and I yeah. I, I appreciate that. Yeah, he should have they should have let him direct Ant Man. He was supposed to direct Ant Man, but then they fired him because I guess he was too weird or wacky. What? But yeah, the so weird and the wacky thing. is awesome. Yeah, so they brought on another director and now Ant Man is a 
mediocre movie. It's it's okay. Hmm. When it could have been amazing. You know, Andrew Wright's mm. an awesome director. Mm. I love his like his whole style is just so cool. I usually Plus, I, I I've like, taken inspiration from him for a lot of the stuff that I've made. Mm. Like, Plus I feel like with a heist movie. Yeah. It, he could like that that kind of like snappy like kinetic editing and like yeah you know. he did Baby Driver which is that I saw that that's a good movie I love that movie yeah I haven't watched that Edgar Wright likes Queen um <laughs> which is cool because they play one of my favorite Queen songs Bright and Rock in Baby Driver and also Don't Stop Me Now that scene I know we passed yeah. it Shaun of the Dead oh, that yeah, scene where like, like they the... beat the guy to Don't yeah. Stop Me Now little, another little, one of my little favorite Shaun Queen of the Dead moment they actually oh, and, uh, they, I liked the actually... part where he was like flipping the switches on beat I thought that oh my part god, was cool. it's so cool he didn't yeah, yeah Edgar Wright didn't even know if like he wrote that into the scene without knowing that if they would be able to get the rights or not so he sent yeah. like a begging letter to I think the guitarist of Queen um, just being like, please let us use this song, and he's like, okay. No, it I wasn't, didn't know that. It wasn't like a very popular, like it wasn't a very popular Queen song at the time. So oh, it, it kind of like re- it kind of like such a good jazz song. is such a good album. Yeah, cool it kind of like revitalized that song, or like you know, made it more popular. Yeah, which is cool. They also use um, uh, you're my best friend in the credits of that song. I mean, credit credits, credits of that, that movie, <laughs> which I think is cool. Yeah. Also, yeah, yeah. I think. Shaun of the Dead with the Don't Stop Me Now scene was one of the first, like, it kind of started a trend of, like, movies using licensed songs, Mm -hmm. for better or for worse, I don't know. Shaun of the Dead, I feel like, is the movie that got me, like, really into Queen, because, like, I knew all the hits, but then, like, once once I saw that movie, I started (laughs) digging deeper Mm -hmm. into it, Mm. and... That makes one of us. Well, I know that's not your kind of music, but Queen's my favorite band. So, yippee! Yeah, partially because of this movie. Partially. That's neat. So, yeah. My goodness, anyway. Una, Una Lore? Una Lore? Una Lore? Whoa. Ooh, no. Ooh, Lore. Is... No, no, I don't no, think it I, doesn't nothing work. works. Lorna? I was trying, I was, I swear, I was trying to come up L- with, like, a, a pun with your name, like, with one of the movie titles, and I just couldn't. I was like, Shuna of the Dead? <laughs> Shuna of the that, Dead? That works, I guess. Shuna, Shuna of the Dead? Of the Shuna of the Dead. Shuna the Dead? I don't know. The, uh, the, uh, who? Huna? <laughs> Huna, f- Huna Fuzz. I had, the, I had the, the thought the huh, Huna. Huna, but then I was like, no, no, no. The what? What? I thought Huna, but then I was like, no. Absolutely not. Anyway, back I'm sorry, to... what? <laughs> no, would you say that for me? Because I did not hear you. We like like Una Hot movie. Oh yeah, like Una what Hot you, movie. I don't know what they're talking you about. You were there when we, we filmed, filmed it. it for us. Oh yeah, <laughs> I do remember that. I do know what they're talking about, oh and I God. just lied. <laughs> Why would you lie like that? We're gonna cancel you even more yeah, now. Yeah, we're gonna. We should make it. This That's title fine. is. This episode's gonna be titled Theo gets canceled real. Not clickbait. The podcast ends for Theo because he, he got kicked off. Oh no, Theo's not gonna show up next episode. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Mm-hmm. Well, too late. You already, we already had the next movie be a movie that I'm gonna be on. For. <sighs> so it would have been really, it would have been really funny <laughs> if I wasn't on the next episode. We should switch the the Maybe movie. Maybe I should have let you do Clue. Well, now they'll know. Now they'll know. We already said the name of the movie earlier. Yeah, you did. So back to uh, World's End. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. Any anything else? We're not running. We're, I like the movie. A good movie. An hour um, long episode is a great idea. Anyways, um, and we can definitely keep them. Uh, the was there any like for what? Don't Sorry. check your phone for eight balls. <laughs> I thought it was something important. Um. Who cares? My Can phone buzzed earlier. I don't care. My, I don't know. My talk dad about, might have had a stroke. Uh, I don't know. Can we please talk about <laughs> specific scenes or quotes that we liked in uh, The World's End? And maybe Shaun of the Dead, because we didn't do that Thea, for Shaun of the Dead. My dad might have had a stroke. I don't care. <laughs> dad, I know you're having a stroke, but please, I'm doing a podcast right now. That's not my problem. <laughs> Drive yourself to the hospital, okay? Dad, I know you're in terrible pain right now. But, but I'm 
I'm but talking I'm, about a movie right I'm now. I'm literally podcasting right now. <laughs> Chat, I'm podcasting. It'd be, it would suck if my dad actually had a stroke. Oh, God. Okay. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's, let's, talk about, let's talk about specific quotes and scenes that we like from The World's End and maybe Shaun of the Dead in a second. Don't be daft. It was written by Jesus. Yeah, that whole scene was really funny. Me, <laughs> Una, Una. What, what? Do you have any scenes you want to talk about? I like when the um the 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 guy from the church says Jesus Christ after he get after he gets shot in the foot. It's funny. From what? Hot fuzz. Oh. I was it, talking about World's End specifically. Oh, World's End. I thought you just meant in general. No, I said World's End, and then maybe Shaun of the Dead in a second. Oh. Oh well. I I said a hot fuzz quote, so sue me. I will. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Anyways, so um, I think Boy, that yeah. I think the before I wasn't paying attention. Uh, before um, uh, before the aliens showed up, I think the the only thing that I actually like saw was when um the 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 four of them were at the table waiting for Gary to come back, and uh oh, my father texted me. See, I'm not Did the only he have one. A stroke? <laughs> uh, no. This is a terrible bit. <laughs> Please don't say that. Let's not manifest that. This is a that would terrible, be bad. awful bit. Um, and I love it so much. I'll throw a chair at you, Theo. That's fine. Um, <laughs> sorry, I, I'm sorry, I'm Una Max. I was right gonna now. say um, the the scene where they're, the four of them are sitting waiting for Gary, but Gary's playing a video game in the window. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, that that was the only one that like really s- stuck with me. Um, I, I don't know why. Uh, I think it's just because it like proves that like again he's very childish and like hasn't grown up. Also, the fact that when when he like pulls out like the I don't know what what phone he pulls out, but what are you guys doing? <laughs> Sorry. What phone does he pull out? Uh, uh, it was, it was a. He pulls out yeah. some really old phone, and yeah. and I was like, oh my god! I saw that, and I was like, whoa! Wait it's, a second! It's funny once you remember that this movie came out in like 2014 or something, or maybe 2013. But oh yeah, 2013 like, it is. The iPhone was definitely out by then. Oh yeah, because the other other people had iPhones, right? Yeah, that was yeah. the whole point. It's to show that he like hasn't yeah, moved on. Exactly. Uh, so, you know, oh, the I'm small little things like that. yeah, Edgar Wright's no, okay. so good at that. Yeah, the the very small like s- details are very good. I love them very much. Yeah. Um, any kind, of, I love small details and that don't matter in the end, but they make me happy, uh, like an unreasonable amount. Like they don't need to make me happy. They're just like, oh my he, gosh, wait, he that's forgot so to cool. tie his shoe. That's so in character. Oh my god, he would do that. I don't know, just like small little things make me so happy like that. I've seen her like, yeah, from old Zen. When he, when he falls on the car and he's, <laughs> and he's like, don't, should we crawl down the drain pipe? He's like, no, this will be faster. And he's like, maybe you should crawl down the drain pipe. When he's like, he lands on a car and is just like incapacitated. Yeah, yeah, I don't know why he thought that was a good idea. That's so me, Clark. I guess he saw, I guess he saw Home Alone too. I was like, that looks like a good idea. Mm. And he failed to realize that it was a, a way to hurt the bad guy and not give them fun treats and a fun little uh-huh. thing to do. Oh, yeah. yeah. The other thing, I remember now about the ending you said you didn't like. Mm-hmm. I wasn't like a huge fan of the ending, but that very last scene where he's in the bar and he orders yeah. a tap water. Yeah. I love that yeah, because it's it the... comes back yeah, earlier. And he's like, true Edgar bravery. Edgar so cool. Because tr- he said yeah. true bravery is going into a bar and ordering a water and not caring what other people think. Yeah, he's like, it ta- that takes some real yeah. confidence and stuff. And, mm-hmm. and, and then he's like, Cause, Why did you order a tap water Because Gary called a him a baby for not getting alcohol. Yeah, and then and then he does the same thing Later in, in, on. in another bar, and it's 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 cool. Yeah, I love I again references Character like that where they like bring yeah. back. Yeah, that's it's such a cool mm-hmm. way to and change his definitely. character. I'm Gary King, and I have water. So you should give me some, man. We don't have that long left. 
Okay, but I still want water. Die though. Soon. Of a stroke. <laughs> oh my god! When I said I like it when bits come back, I don't mean it like that. That's not what I meant. That bit is not funny. <laughs> it's not funny. Bad, Theo. Bad. 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 <laughs> I shake my fist at you. Ugh. <laughs> It's crazy how he thinks this is that funny. Too. It is not. Haha, <laughs> 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 that <head> stroke. <laughs> <laughs> I, all I could see was the, the, the monkey impression. <laughs> from uh, Shaun of the Dead. From Shaun yeah. of the Dead. Oh my gosh. He does impressions in, in a couple of them, right? Hmm. Like, also, can I just say, I, I really liked how in um, all three of the movies, uh, they all, Simon Pegg is such a good actor. He, he's like, all of them are so different. Like, so a, different. Mm, like, such like good Nick, uh, Nick, he's like Nicholas Angel. Uh, he's like super strict. And then eventually his character development is letting uh, loose up, but also being able to get back on task quickly as well. So he's still very professional, but he is a little, you know, more relaxed now, which is good for him. Yeah. Um, and then Sean is kind of like um, a little is, is aloof the right word? I don't. Okay, a loop. Uh, uh, I don't know the definition by art, so. Me either. I've um, learned since eighth grade English, and I'm not about to look that up. Makes sense. Um, but I yeah, he's kind of aloof and like doesn't really like focus on anyone else except for him and Ed. Uh, and then, um, but then he learns to like actually like take responsibility. But he's still a silly little guy. Yeah. Um, and uh, and then Gary King is. Gary King. Yeah, uh, his development's crazy. There's, mm -hmm. there's no, there's no other way to describe Gary King than just that he's, guy is he's Gary, Gary King. King. Dude, you're Gary Kinging right now. Yeah. Dude, I'm Gary Kinging around. Hey, you want to go Gary King around after the podcast? Psh, totally, man. Anyway, <laughs> yeah. isn't uh, that what? Never mind. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, but yeah, just like his like ability to play these different characters is so Maybe. cool to me. Speaking of different characters. Are you on the on the on the oh, yeah, guy? We the, it, we we're the at the guys. end and you're just mentioning it now. Yeah, the little men. Better late than you never, mean I guess. the Cornettos? Those the are not men. men. Oh. Those are ice cream. At ease, soldier. <laughs> Okay, anyway. Anywho. What a bit. I forgot it was there. Oh my god. Chat, we're bidding right now. Anyways. Bits. Um, yeah, bits. and uh, and there's also the uh what wait, what's the other guy's name? I forget. It's <laughs> it's what? is it written down? I feel like it's it's not. No, no it is. Wait, no. It? The the um <laughs> the uh, who who plays Ed? Nick Frost? Yeah, him. He also that has guy. a good acting range as well. I feel like, um... Yeah, Shaun of the Dead was, like, I feel like one of Ed his first and, um, roles, and he did really good. Yeah, no, they're both such good actors. Ed and... I don't know. I feel like Ed and Danny are sort of similar, but not at the same time. Because, like, Danny, he's still, like, uh... He, he wants to, like, work, um... Like, when... Uh, when Nick shows up, he's like, whoa, I want to be a super cool action cop like you. Um, and he wants to do it, but Ed is very much, he does not want to do work at all. Uh, yeah. But but I do, like, personality-wise, they're kind of similar. They're both, like, si they're just, you know, silly guys. He wants to have fun, you know? Seeing Nick Frost in a serious role in The World's End is so cool to me, since, like, mm -hmm. he doesn't usually play roles right. like that. Yeah, so uh, like, so, like Nick, Nick Frost was only in like one or two things before Shaun of the Dead, and like the people in charge, I don't know, wanted uh, someone else to play uh, the roommate for his name was it Ed. 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 Ed or Pete. Ed. Yeah, it was Ed. 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 Um and um. But there, Edgar Wright and Sean, Simon Pegg were like, I almost said Sean Pegg. Sean uh, but Pegg. Edgar Wright and Simon Pegg were like, no, it's got to be this guy, and it really helped a lot because of the chemistry. Yeah. And, like, the no, they work super yeah. well together. Mm-hmm. They've done a ton of movies together. Mm-hmm. Yippee. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, is there anything else we want us to talk about specifically? Uh, if someone wants to talk a, more, a little more about Hot Fuzz, we totally can. I don't think that I talked about Hot Fuzz on that episode, so I don't know what else I would say. Yeah, um, I covered pretty much all the bases on the episode. Mm -hmm. on it. You? And I don't have a thought in my head right now. You never do. Affectionate, don't worry. <laughs> 
Um, yeah. Uh, was there... I don't think we said any specific scenes for Shaun of the Dead, did we? I like the Don't Stop Me Now scene. Mm, that's what you said. Queen. Right, you Ooh. said that. I, I don't think I said one specifically oh, the record one's also so good oh yeah oh, yeah. yeah the record like, one is fun i like the one where they like keep having to revise their plan mm. yeah that's funny that one is funny um <laughs> and then every time they go through it it's like it gets a little bit like like at first they're like sorry what, what's the guy's name the the the, the grandpa uncle stepdad yeah philip <laughs> philip philip sorry philip <laughs> Yeah, like, at first they say it in length, and then they're, like, sorry, and then it, like, shortens every time. Mm -hmm. And they just don't say it on the third one. It's funny. Yeah, I, I, do, I do like that. Again, attention to detail. Awesome. Um, uh, I was Actually, speaking of Philip, um, uh, I don't know. I liked, uh, I kind of like how they gave him that scene in the car where he, like, died. And um, I kind of like how he died. That was awesome. <laughs> I wish he died more. <laughs> oh my gosh, why are you people, like, impossible to ever say anything around? Yeah. <laughs> I hate you guys so much. Dude, that, that really means a lot. Thank you. Where's the menthol cry stick? I want to make oh this look Oh my god! <laughs> I hate you! Um, anyways... Uh, I, I liked how that scene, like, gave him, like, um, like, like, a motivation for why he was, like, like, because he was really trying to just be, like, like, tell Sean, like, uh, like, an actual dad, like, be, like, come on, you have to do this, you know, don't forget to do this, and just, like, the, the reminders of that stuff, and yeah. we have, like, two minutes left, and you're actually just buttoning that now. Okay, I realized I forgot one of the buttons, so, um, we can edit that in post, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> uh, anyway, um, but yeah, I, I like how they actually like gave it because like before that it was literally just like oh, Sh Sean's stepdad that he doesn't like, and that was it. And he didn't really have a character to him. But then they gave him that scene, and it felt like he was definitely more. He felt more real to me after that. And um, stop playing footsie. <laughs> we would never. <sighs> Why <laughs> <laughs> oh, is that so drawn out? <laughs> you guys can't do it like I can. I'm better than you guys. It's like a balloon deflating. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, no, final like, ratings. Uh, no, final ratings. I can't, uh, I can't Shaun of the Dead. I think I. I think I was like. Um, I think. Uh, that reminds nope. me of something, but I can't say it right now. Um, okay. Because we're talking about something else. Uh, I think my final rating for Shaun of the Dead, probably, I think... Shaun of the Dead. I don't remember. I think I said four. I don't remember. I put it on my letterbox. I think it was four. Um, it's fine. I think I rated it four out of five. What's your Shaun of the Dead rating? Uh... Sean, four and a half, and then Hot Fuzz and World's End are both fives. I love those you're, movies. You're Sean? You're, you're Sean. No, you're Sean. I'm gay. I, I am Sean. Sean. I am Sean, kid. actually. I am Sean. Um, I'd say, um... Sean the Dead, zero. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Hot Fuzz, zero. <laughs> World's End... <laughs> One hundred. <laughs> One hundred out of uh like three. One hundred <laughs> out of I don't know, eighty seven? Oh. Okay then. Uh my world's end I don't remember what I four, I think I four to five, five oh no, four point five out of five and then the world's, five out of five. Okay. The world's In end order. for me was uh I think I think I said three. Uh, I liked it. It just, again, to me, it just felt like there were two stories that were trying to both tell, like, there are two stories being told, and I just don't, and they just didn't mesh well for me. I do really like uh, Gary's um, story, though. I wish it was, like, just his story and not aliens. But I did like the aliens. They were cool, though. Why are the two of us on a podcast? We, are, we, we don't have the same interests. Yeah, you guys which, never agree which on Which makes it no. choosing a movie a nightmare. I, I, yeah. I, I, this, 
Green. All right, like let's bear. let's do let's do the next Only movie, the, the next, movie next movie, next movie, next movie, next movie, next she- movie. Alien. Only one. There's only one of them. Because, there's only one of them. Because it's better when there's one of them. Yeah. Maybe just one of us should do that podcast. Yeah. Since Honestly, Theo, maybe them. maybe it should just be you. So you yeah, can yeah, give that it's apology. It's just me sitting like alone, just like, um, so alien. It was, was kind of really good. good. Um, I liked so it. it. And like then there's just like 10 minutes of you like podcast. picking at your nails. Except words, it's just me being like, yeah, I, I liked it. Yeah. Um... Anyway, so it was like Alien, horror, next movie, yeah. yippee. yippee. All right, we're done now. We're done now. We're done. Um, uh, Went we're over d- a little bit, but that's okay. That's fine. We're going to, you know what we're all going to do? We're, we're all going to go to the Winchester. Yeah. Grab a nice cold pint and wait for all this to blow, blow over. over. Yes, we are. Bye.